Teenagers are supposed to spend their weekends at the movies. They're supposed to get home late and get told off by their parents but not really care because they had such a great time. Teenagers are supposed to have friends. But I don't. I don't have any friends. So what time are you going to be home then? No, eleven o'clock. Okay, twelve. I'll come and get you at midnight. Say hello to Sophie for me. Okay, have fun. Bye. I used to have friends, lots of them. So many that it didn't seem like there were enough days in the week to see everybody. My sister has just as many friends now as I did then. She's, she sees them every weekend. She gets home late and she gets told off by my parents, but she doesn't really care. It makes me feel like a little bit of a loser sometimes. Because I just stay at home. And then she gets back and she tells me about everything she did when she was out. And what have I got to tell her? Not much. <laughs> Not having any friends isn't as bad as everyone says. I mean, sometimes you have really great days and you watch a good film or you read a good book and you have so much time to just think. And that's fun, but then other times I, I wish that I did have friends and not even, not even loads, just one, just one friend. Someone I can sit with in class. Just, you know, someone to do something with when the library's closed. So Dad and I are going away this weekend. Um, Maybe you'd like to get a friend drowned? You have a sleepover and um, get a pizza delivered or something like that. I've actually got quite a lot of homework to do this weekend. Um, I think I'll pass. Is, is Amber, is Amber around? I don't think so, she might be out. Mm. That's fine. Um, you sure you won't be lonely though? No, 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 I'll be fine. I'm, I'll see someone on Saturday or something. I used to have friends and I sometimes pretend I still do. It's, it's less embarrassing that way. My parents think I'm still best friends with Alexandra, even though she hasn't come around for two or three years, because that's what I told them. But really, when I go out, I'm not seeing anyone. I'm just by myself, and I hate that I have to lie to them. What's the alternative? Not lying, and them knowing that I'm a loser, and knowing that I have no friends. Um, 
Okay, so Alexander has asked if I want to go to the Tate with her on Sunday. Is that okay? Of course it is. I haven't seen Alexandra for ages. Say hello for me, won't you? Yeah, no, it's been a while. Yeah, I'll say you say hi. Um, I should go let her know that I can that I can come. Okay, good. I hate that I have to lie to them. It's just easier. But then I realised something. If I didn't make an effort to talk to anyone, if I accepted that I'd never have any friends, well then I'd never have any friends. I didn't think anyone would want to be my friend. I tried talking to people to see if I could find a friend. Turns out she didn't have any friends either. I never noticed that other people were lonely too because I was so focused on my own loneliness. Kind of selfish when you think about it. But she was lonely too. The worst thing about not having any friends is that you think it will never end and you think you will never have friends. But everything is transient. I didn't used to have any friends, but now I do.